Hello, this is Kevin from Crypto MY. In today's episode, let's talk about Metaverse Coin and let's stay tuned. So, the platform that I'm using today is MEXC platform. If you guys don't have MEXC account yet, I'll put down the link below. You guys can register straight away. So before I talk about Metaverse, let me talk about this platform. Why I usually personally use this platform is because there has a lot of events, especially uh, when you look at those events, right? Most of those events are all related to all the news tokens that are releasing soon. So usually when all the uh, new tokens, I'm not to say every new tokens, but most of it will actually release on MEXC first before even going to Binance or Hobi or any other platform. So right, you will have the bigger chance to get at the lower price first in MEXC before in other, other platforms. So usually what I do is I will usually open up few accounts like MEXC, uh, Hobi, Binance and all have served different purposes. Like MEXC, I usually take it for like, okay, when I first I see a new certain uh, tokens that are going to release soon on the event itself, I can actually buy it or I can actually, actually take an opportunity to get in early at the early price before anybody else. So let's talk about Metaverse. Okay, Metaverse coins, uh, if you look at it, okay, why am I talking about Metaverse? Because I actually uh, see a comment by Melvin uh can you introduce some metaverse related coin so when we talk about metaverse coin it's like all jumble up in together into a crypto uh doesn't matter is it game or anything utility but if you look at coin gecko metaverse coin you can see that there is a certain ranking so of course everybody know about xc infinity xc infinity is considered the first metaverse coins that comes into the market comes into crypto space and other than that, after that, there's a lot of Metaverse coin. Correct? So, when we talk about Metaverse coin, we want it to be something uh, special or unique. Or at least, uh, when we talk about games, we want the games to be uh, optimized at a very good level, a very, very good quality level. Such as, if you talk at Illuvium, ILV is one of the tokens that's released or the coin that's released recently and I felt that this has a potential. So ILV where you can you purchase, you can actually purchase it MEXC also. So looking at MEXC, let's go into the spot trading itself. And don't forget, by registering a new account from MEXC, you can get a lot of bonuses. So remember to check out MEXC trading platform. So look at ILV. ILV is something very, very interesting whereby it has a significant growth, keep on growing from $28 all the way to $1,003 in the past few months. Why ILV is because ILV has something to do with a triple A graphic game. When you talk about triple A graphic game, if you guys likes to play games, you will see like a Call of Duty, AAA games, uh, those good, good graphic games are all AAA games. So you can see, right, in future uh, on Metaverse Coin or especially in Game 5, uh, all these uh, game developers, all these quality game developers are coming to blockchain and create all these sort of tokens. So it's most likely like a play to earn or you can actually uh, trade your tokens in the game or whatsoever. So look at Illuvium. Why Illuvium is because if you look at uh, Illuvium IO, yes, I actually checked it out earlier. It's beautiful. I love how it, how the looks of the website. I love the characters. I even love the trailer itself. Okay. The trailer is very, very unique whereby it shows uh, a little bit teaser here and there how this game play out. And you can see, uh, I, I'm going to show everything, but I'll put down the link below so you guys can actually watch the whole trailer. So it's much more like an auto battler game. You can see it's a collectible RPG game whereby it's more, much more like a, I don't know, it's a board game or something whereby it come, comes to the board and then you just 
fight against each other, like something like Pokemon or Digimon stuff, which I found it very interesting. At least, you know, you see the graphics itself, it's very, very beautiful, and it kind of catch my attention, to be honest. So, uh, LLB is one of the uh, good games outside that you can actually look at it. And if you ask me uh, whether ILV is good to invest, I think ILV is very good to, for, for investment. So talking about Metaverse, uh, let's talk about uh, other Metaverse coin that I could recommend you guys is the uh, Star Atlas. Star Atlas, I actually talked about it a uh, few months ago. I actually does a video about it, about Star Atlas. And I think Star Atlas also has some potential. Star Atlas is uh, something to do with uh, spaceships sort of stuff. It's also a, a gaming platform where you can actually uh, play with the spaceship. You can buy all the spaceship and then you just play with it. And if you look at the trailer, it's also quite similar to um, what they are offering. Legend has it that somewhere on the other side of space is a diamond the size of a planet. And everyone is out to find it. When uh, Facebook actually announced uh, about its application, the new meta, the products, Mana actually went up, I think, 200% within a short time. So Mana is actually very, very related to what uh, the uh, Mark Zuckerberg is doing right now. And you can see, right, if you look at Decentraland, I think it also has some uh, uniqueness whereby you can purchase and you can create your own virtual world experience. So very, very interesting to see that uh, all these sort of metaverse coins has its own uniqueness. I myself, I actually play uh, Murfo. If you guys don't have Murfo, I actually can share with you guys. Murfo is also another sort of online game and it's integrated with uh, blockchain technology. So you can actually play the games and you can actually sell all the items on the NFT platform. So the NFT platform is coming in November. Very, very interesting. You can see all the heroes. This is much more like, uh, you know, when we are y younger time where people like to grind for levels or go for PVPs, go for clan war, go for all these sort of uh, party. This game is actually very, very unique, uh, especially the graphic itself. It's kind of surprisingly that this graphics is on par with what they are offering right now. So uh, this is actually a Corel game. It's a Corel uh, uh, developer. They actually integrate with blockchain technology to come up with the better version of the game. So uh, there's a lot of coins out there. I couldn't recommend everything, but all these tokens that I recommend, which is the Decentraland, uh, even Engine Coin, I find it's very okay. Uh, Illuvium and also Star Atlas, I think uh, all this has a very, very good potential. But Star Atlas, you need to be taking note that uh, Star Atlas has two coins, very similar to Axie Infinity. X Infinity has uh, X Infinity Gong, which is AXS and also SLP. Okay, so SLP is the game coin and AXS is the whole mother coin, the mother company. So Star Atlas is very similar, whereas Atlas is the game coin and also uh, Police, P O L I S, this one is actually the mother company coin. So if you want to invest, I will advise you to go for the police. If you want to be very supportive on the game coin then uh, means you can purchase uh, the products inside the game or whatsoever then you can actually support Atlas. I think both have potential and yeah there's a lot of games uh, metaverse coins that are releasing so nothing um, it, it, it can be not related to game it can be related to other, other things but uh, today I'll be talking about metaverse uh, especially game towards the game file and I think all these coins that are recommended is all investable because of the products, because of the graphic itself, I actually love uh, how the gameplay works. And to be honest, uh, if you want to buy all these tokens, you can actually purchase it directly from an EXE account. So uh, for example, if you want to purchase Star Atlas, you can actually put EAO 
or uh, uh, sorry, P, uh, uh, police, P-O-L-I-S, it will come, it will show out because most of the tokens outside, I think uh, MEFC will get the first hand on all these tokens first. So for example, if you want to purchase the mana, I think I believe that it has mana. So I think most of the tokens you want, you need, everything will be here. Even the new release of ILB is also there. Okay, so um, I'll put down the link as below for MEXC. Uh, I think MEXC is a very, very good platform if you guys want to purchase or you guys want to see uh, something uh, quick or some new tokens quick or even you want to search, uh, look at popular search because when you want to invest something, uh, I was thinking about hey, what to invest. You can actually look at the popular search like IMX went up 4,000% yesterday uh, when it launched uh, this immutable, uh, this is the token name, and you can see, right, it will pop up at the popular search in the MEXC search right here. So it's very interesting to see MEXC has these uh, features where you can actually look at all these uh, new tokens that's released and all these new token has a lot of hype recently. So you can see uh, how much hype is going on right now, how, what is the lowest hype, so all this, you can actually play around in MEXC Global. Don't forget, you can actually do a lot of things in MEXC uh, in terms of going under the finance uh, tab where it has the launch pad, the Kickstarter, the DeFi, the MDAs, all these sort of features you can actually play around. But of course, today I won't be explaining so much of all these things that are going on in MEXC. You can actually check out by yourself and which one is suitable for you to play out. So I think that's all for today's episode. If you like my episode today, remember to click like, share, and subscribe. Gonna see you guys soon, and goodbye.